Nine Wayne Hill High School football players have been benched after they were charged with aggravated assault. And the school came under fire after the players were allowed to participate in the playoff game last Friday, even after the allegations came to light. For more on the story, let's go on the record now with Matt McGrath. Matt, thank you for joining us. What is happening with these Nine Wayne Hills players? Uh, well, the superintendent yesterday issued a statement saying that the, they are going to be suspended from all extracurricular activities, including sports, uh, until uh, there is a decision made um, in the court system. Yeah, a lot of controversy about this. Uh, the fact, perhaps, that uh, this wasn't done before that last playoff game. And it uh, seems like this has really hit a nerve in the community. Uh, it really has. Uh, there, there are two uh, separate camps that are, that are really forming. There's uh, the camp um, that was really the most vocal over the past week. Uh, they believe that the players should have been suspended as soon as the charges uh, came to light. Um, immediately, uh, they were arrested on election night, and um, the, everyone was made aware of them on the next Wednesday. Uh, they think that the players should have been suspended immediately and um, basically uh, to, to teach them a lesson that there are consequences to some of their actions. Now, the other camp is uh, saying that the no punishment at all should be handed down until uh, the, the, there, there's a decision in the court system. Well, this kind of goes along with that whole Penn State uh, controversy that uh, athletes are above the law or, uh, you know, the, uh, the team. Uh, it, it seems like it kind of hit at the same time that everybody's talking about that. What are your thoughts? Well, the, the, the co there is the, this, this great coincidence between um, the, the Penn State controversy and the Wayne Hills controversy and a number of people uh, who have commented on stories uh, have sent me emails, have called me. They have also um, drew, the, uh, drew those same parallels. There is a feeling that the Wayne Hills football program and the people involved in the Wayne Hills football program do believe that, uh, that, that, that they are above the law or need some sort of special status. Uh, but obviously, on the other side, they're saying that, uh, that, they, that that's just not true, and they just want um, a decision in the courts. And just real quick, what is next uh, with this? Well, there's a, a Board of Education meeting uh, tonight, and uh, a lot of people are expected uh, to show up and to voice their concerns and their grievances over the way this entire controversy was handled. And uh, we're, we're intending to be there to cover the, cover the event. Um, we're going to live blog it, and there'll definitely be a story in tomorrow's paper. We're going to look for that, Matt. We thank you for coming on today. For more news, weather, traffic, and sports, tune into Fios 1 News New Jersey, only on Channel 1, only on Verizon.